Hi, uh, I'm Paul Feuerstein, technology editor of Dentistry Today, and I'm here today with Dan Call from Bien Air. Hi, Dan, how, how are you? Very, very good. I have to tell a quick story about uh, Bien Air. I was out in uh, California in uh, Costa Mesa, don't feel bad for me, and I went to this mall called South Coast Mall, and it had all these elaborate jewelry stores. I'm walking up and down the aisles, and what do I see? This amazing Swiss watch, and I said, wow, I want one of those. And they said, it's a mere $72,000. And I went, wow. And all I could think of was, I have Bien Air, a Swiss handpiece that doesn't cost $72,000, but it works as good as any fine piece of time work, time clock. So uh, anyway, uh, over the years, uh, I've, I've really had a, a lot of fun working with Bien Air. And uh, one of the things that they've done over the years is, in fact, made the whole system smaller. One of the problems that I had earlier on with, hand, with electric handpieces with the size, and now they've shortened the whole thing. They've had a short motor, a shorter whole system here, much lighter, more ergonomic. What do you think, how does that work out then? Yeah, we're very excited to introduce another first by BNR. and Air. Um, as you all know already, we were the first to introduce a line of small contra angles. The combination of motor and attachment are the smallest in the world. This greatly decreases on hand fatigue, puts the balance right in the center of your palm, makes for a very efficient instrument. That's, that's terrific. So in terms of innovation, at this, at what they've introduced right now is an iPod controller, which I originally thought, that's interesting, it's a little iPod, you can push the buttons, but it's a lot more than that, more than a controller. It's a complete system attached to the, uh, to the hand pieces. Give me a little briefing on how this iPod interfaces with the hand piece system itself. Yes, so another first by BNR, Air, we're the first company to introduce the iPad platform as a control for our electric motor. The idea behind this, of course, was the user-friendly uh, the user friendliness of the Apple platform. Most people are familiar with this concept and with these products, and so now they can use the same thing they already know and love to control their, their dental instrument. Now, when, when I do crown and bridge, for example, I use a certain setting for my basic prep, and I use a different setting for my margin refinement. Uh, in fact, one of the problems that I see with electric hand pieces is, as you see, is a dentist buys an electric hand piece, is used to an air turbine, steps on the gas, and does 200,000 for everything, and the whole point of an electric is you can modify all these things. So I was told that I, it will remember my settings? That's correct. The, uh, the user interface is the iPod Touch, and the iPod Touch is designed to accept as many user settings as the memory will hold, so more than any dentist will ever use. But what it does is create a one-touch feature that will allow you to switch from high speed to slow speed with one attachment, which is also a BNR first. Wow. Now, I don't do a lot of endo, but I've, I've used these for, for uh, some endo of my own, and in my office we also use endo. And there seems to be some interface with the endo files and the iPod system too? That's correct. Another uh, capacity of the Apple platform is that we are able to preload it with all of the different endo files produced by every manufacturer on the market. This is a great convenience because if you ever want to switch from endo file to endo file, the presets will be preloaded on there. Also, we can update it remotely from Switzerland so the product never goes out of date. So how does it know which file I'm using? Uh, you can select it. You can select the file in the endo mode. You can go to the settings, the settings page, and it will give you a list with all of the different manufacturers' endo files that we have preset. And so, so it knows if it's a certain series, it'll automatically know that. Exactly, and these series, they come, you know, the manufacturer will give the specifications of the torque, which is for the auto reverse feature. Uh, when the torque limit is achieved, the system will automatically detect that, engage in reverse. This system is, has another exclusive feature brought by BN Air, first of its kind. It has auto forward, so you can select, you can designate an a interval of time. After auto reverse is engaged, after a half a second, the system will automatically go back into forward, so it's completely automated endodontics. And it will pre pro so, but I can pre if I don't want to do the exact specifications, do I have a little control over this too? Absolutely, it's completely customizable. That's unbelievable. Yes. Now, I was told by somebody <laughs> that down the road, if, if things change, this can be upgraded? Yes, so this system is when you purchase it, the, the Apple platform will allow us to remotely update it keeping you uh, always up to date with any products that are released by endophile manufacturers. And then I think the pie in the sky would be, could this ever be interfaced with my patient data or anything like that? Yes, uh, BN Air is the first in working with universities as well as product leaders to develop a platform that will interface with practice management software. Soon you'll be able to view the patient's file on the iPod as well as some other features. 
So I, if I know I'm doing a, if, I, if the name, patient's name pops up, it says you're doing a crown or whatever it is, it'll pop up on there. And don't ask, would it, would it set up my settings? Uh, it can set up your settings if, that, if you would like to select that. Um, also, because it's hooked up to Wi-Fi and the internet through the, uh, through the iPod, you can watch a quick tutorial or even your favorite video by Dr. Fuerstein <laughs> to go over some things you might have learned or some products you might have saw. So if, if someone needs more information, I mean, this is really evolving quickly. Uh, how, do the, how does a dentist get the, the latest information on what's going on over here? To get the latest information, you can visit us at our website, bnair.com. Bnair.com. Can we spell that? B as in boy, I-E-N-A-I-R. Thank you. Thanks a lot, Dan. This has been great. Thank you. Thanks so much.